someone has liked my presentation. It's so great. In my social media, I'm searching for something um, cool thing. Oh, I got an educational thing. It is, um, I think it's about grammatical. Oh, yes, I have found a very interesting fact. Oh, yeah, what a great thing it is. So, Assalamu Alaikum everyone. This is me, your learning partner, Azwat Abrar. I'm a 7th grade student at Kasi Model School and College. And also, I'm a Chiso learner. So, today, in this video, I'm going to tell you an enchanting topic. And most of you love to use those things. So, my today's topic will be about social media and social website or you can also say social media and websites so without any extra time wasting let's start our today's presentation well we all love to use social media because it's our habit and also we love to use it for different types of activities so so, um, if we talk about what is social media, what is the meaning of social media? So it is, social media is a tool that is becoming very popular and very fascinating those days and in this modern world because of its user-friendly features. Now, our world, our earth is now a modern world. All the things are based on technologies and also behind that the websites for communication, the social media, everything is creating through websites. We are using Python coding to create those websites and if we talk about social media, there are lots of social medias. Suppose if we say about one social media that is very popular and very, I mean, usable website it is Facebook. Facebook is the most popular website. It is invented by Mark Zuckerberg. I think all of you know about this. And also YouTube are there. YouTube also developed by Google company. And there are uh, other websites like Safari of iOS, Mozilla Firefox, Opera browser, or you can also say Instagram, TikTok, Messenger, Telegram, WhatsApp, Messen uh, WhatsApp, Facebook. These are the most usable and popular apps and also the websites. So, you know that we all those social medias, we can connect with each other. So, while what we are outside or what we are inside. Suppose if I talk about a real life that, suppose my relatives are at London and I'm in Bangladesh and if I talk with them on messenger the social website then I can call to them at any time then we can call, uh, talk with each other through virtually so we don't have to go to that place to meet with our relatives in our house and on their house we can uh, we can talk together by using messenger or virtually it's so easy. So, um, if I talk about another advantage, it is when we about uh, when we don't understand any types of things like educational base, or if we don't understand any mental metric or any other English grammatical forms or any other mathematics signs or any other general knowledge based questions, we search for YouTube, the most usable social uh, media. So, we use it to watch lots of videos, there are lots of funny videos like memes and there are lots of educational videos like Hashim al uh, the science based, the technology based, news and new inventions, there are lots of uh, things about to learn about planets and our subject, academic subject that we don't understand, we can easily solve them by through understanding by using the YouTube. So YouTube is the most helpful and also behind that Facebook is the most helpful. Like um, suppose if you want to do any course through live session, if you want to do any live session, suppose um, a lecture or a live session is going on at other 
country like New Zealand or England or UK or USA, in this type of country there are lots of lectures and courses held. So if you want to do their course, then what should you do? Should you go to th that country for buying those course? No, we should not do any much longer work. Our, we have Facebook, we have YouTube, we have social websites, so nothing is uh, impossible to do. Through Facebook, we can buy any courses, the course that you would want to do, you can buy any of them through so giving the money, through any payment transaction system, so that they can get the money and you can join the course and they can give you the materials, the study materials through their website. So easy nowadays. And you know that behind lots of advantages of social media, there are also dangerous facts about it. So some of us think that, oh, only Facebook, YouTube, social media, TikTok, Messenger, all these have the advantages only. There's nothing at disadvantages to do. And there is lots of uh, disadvantages and behind that. So we should very much careful about those social media. So let's talk about some disadvantages that is occurring nowadays for social media. Well, some of the nations recognize or some of the scientists recognize that social media is the most harmful element or harmful media of the society. And it invades our privacy and security that something we are keeping so secret in it is in our personal matter and we don't want to share with anyone. Through so social media, everyone knows about your privacy, knows about your personal details that you don't want to share. And it can destroy everything of your personal, uh, personal matters. Like if we talk about some personal details or documents, that is very important for all of us. And I mean very important for that person and that person don't want to share with anyone. And if it, is, it goes to social media, those documents, the other, one, other ones can take all those documents and can copy their documents. So it can cause huge problems to you while you go to any places for anything, for any um, form, work, to those you need those papers. So if the papers are, I mean, published in the Facebook, so everyone can watch and copy your paper, so many times your errors can come to you. And it also leads to hacking, predators, and cyberbullying. When uh, someone uh, knows about anyone's Facebook ID, then they hack our Facebook and they suck lots of money from other people. So many for this many people are being humiliated and getting suicide day by day for using this social website. And for this social website the suicide rate is increasing day by day in our country Bangladesh. So social media is very harmful for the kids also. Nowadays COVID pandemic is rising so we should do online classes for uh, studying and going to school classes but our some of us think that um, some of us plays games behind doing classes so they can give concentration and they uh, check Facebook for this they can do any uh, good things about educational things they don't do any concentration in studies they pass the whole day whole time on Facebook or social media so that they're knowledge and creativity is destroyed day by day. And also, the students do lots of creative activities like arts, physical activities, playing with friends. They're not playing and they're passing a lot of time using technology and their brain is hampering also. So, uh, some scientists discovered that those who use the uh, social media most, they are the uh, they are suffered by mental, psychological problem and also they are faced lots of heart diseases, cancer or brain cancer. This type of dangerous disease occurs with those who use social media most. And sometimes fake news is true.
transferred through social media. And for this, the citizens unite together, the bonding of peace-loving citizens is getting decreased and the cruel quer, quer, uh, and quarrel is increasing day by day. And also, these are the things or disadvantages that are mostly done nowadays. Well, you should keep in mind that everything has a limit. And if you cross any limit or if you do any excess limit, then it is very harmful for our, your health and harmful for your life. And it is also regarded in case of social media. So, if you pay very much attention on your educational matters, your uh, physical activities, and pass some time with your father, mother, daughters, and do some creative things. So for this, and also use social media very low. Because you don't have to do anything with social media. You just chat and I mean, give a like, share and subscribe only. So there is nothing to do. You should only make presentations with on YouTube and do some creative things so that you can increase your knowledge. So with this thought, I would like to conclude my presentation today. So my lovely viewers, I hope you have liked this presentation. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe my YouTube channel as well. And stay with me to learn something, more things that is needed to learn for our practical life. So till then, Assalamu alaikum, bye bye, happy learning.